No stranger to the limelight, Burt Reynolds captured audiences with his magnetic charm and rugged good looks. His charismatic smile and distinctive features quickly solidified his status as a Hollywood Prince Charming. Despite becoming the heartthrob of many, the actor found himself battling personal demons. Tragically, his dependency on prescription pills led to a tumultuous lifestyle that nearly claimed his life. This classic tale serves as a poignant reminder of the destructive consequences that can arise when fame and fortune overshadow personal well-being. Delving deeper into the complexities of this beloved figure offers insight into the often challenging lives of those who captivate us on screen. Burt Reynolds was a beloved figure in Hollywood, known for his charming personality and dazzling mustache. He was a likable character, both on and off the screen, and had a reputation for being unyielding to upset. In fact, he was often referred to as the guy not to be trusted with women, unless you wanted him to take over your girlfriend. Despite his charming persona, Reynolds faced his fair share of personal struggles in life. However, he lived extravagantly and was more glamorous in real life than in the movies. He was one of the last true A-lister film characters, known for his work in classics such as Smokey and The Bandit and Deliverance. Reynolds was well aware of his charm and knew how to use it to his advantage. He was a charismatic and captivating presence, both on and off the screen. Despite his reputation as a ladies' man, he had a softer side and was known for his generosity and kindness. Despite his many personal struggles, Reynolds remained a beloved figure in Hollywood until the end. He will always be remembered for his iconic mustache, his charming personality, and his incredible contributions to the world of film and television. His legacy continues to resonate with fans of all ages, and his work will be cherished for generations to come. Burt Reynolds, the mustachioed superstar, faced significant struggles with substance abuse in the latter part of his life. Following addiction to the contentious prescription sleeping pill Halcyon, his health and career were impacted. Despite these challenges, he remained a beloved figure in the film industry, known for his charm, wit, and undeniable talent. Reynolds' career spanned decades, and he became a household name in the 1970s and 1980s. His films, including Smokey and The Bandit and Deliverance, showcased his versatility as an actor and endeared him to audiences. His charisma and good looks made him a favorite among fans, and his sense of humor and appreciation for his fans set him apart from his peers. However, as the actor's career continued, he faced personal struggles that affected his health and well-being. His addiction to Halcyon, a powerful prescription sleeping pill, led to a downward spiral that included multiple hospitalizations and public incidents. Despite these challenges, Reynolds continued to work in the industry, appearing in films and television shows that showcased his talent and charm. Despite his struggles, Reynolds remained a beloved figure in the industry. His fans appreciated his work and his appreciation for their support. He was a special breed of the last vanishing movie stars, a classic leading man who brought joy and entertainment to audiences for decades. The question remains, will there ever be another Burt Reynolds? It's unlikely that we will see another actor quite like him. His talent, charm and wit were one of a kind, and his impact on the industry is still felt today. His contributions to film and television continue to resonate with audiences, and his legacy will live on for generations to come. In the end, Burt Reynolds was a delight to watch, and his unending devotion to his fans was evident in everything he did. His struggles with substance abuse were a difficult chapter in his life, but they did not define him. Instead, he will be remembered for his talent, his charm, and his unforgettable contributions to the world of film and television. Burt Reynolds, the Smokey and the Bandit star, was one of the highest paid actors of his time. His rise to fame was meteoric, and he quickly became a household name. However, his personal life was filled with controversy. Reynolds was known for his romantic escapades, jumping from bed to bed with several glamorous ladies, including Farrah Fawcett, Goldie Hawn, Dinah Shore, and Sally Field. His separation from Judy Carn made him a bachelor for several years, and some women were satisfied being mistresses. Many people thought that Reynolds used women the way he wanted, but regrettably, he seemed to suggest the opposite. Despite his regrets, Reynolds' charm and good looks made him a favorite among his fans. The actor's career spanned over five decades, and he appeared in numerous films and television shows. His performances were always memorable, and he left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Reynolds' legacy will live on for generations to come, and his fans will always cherish his contributions to this classic art form. Despite his success, Reynolds remained humble and down-to-earth. He was known for his quick wit 
and sense of humor, and he always had a kind word for his fans. Reynolds' impact on the entertainment industry cannot be overstated, and his fans will always remember him as one of the greatest actors of his time. In the end, Burt Reynolds' life was a testament to his talent, charm, and charisma. He will always be remembered as a true Hollywood legend, and his fans will continue to celebrate his contributions to this classic art form. Burt Reynolds, a man known for his charm and good looks, was once described as a shorthand for male sex appeal. However, his relationships with women were not always smooth sailing. In fact, his romantic entanglements were often tumultuous and contributed to his well-documented struggles with addiction. During the height of his career, Reynolds found himself consuming five to six sleeping pills at a time, sometimes even multiple times a day. This excessive use of medication was an attempt to quiet his mind and escape the pressures of his fame. The actor's addiction troubles were further exacerbated by the women in his life, who he admitted messed him up. Despite these challenges, Reynolds remained a beloved figure in Hollywood. His charm and charisma were on full display in his many film and television roles, and his fans continued to support him through thick and thin. It's worth noting that while Reynolds' relationships with women were complex, and at times damaging, they were also a significant part of his life and career. The actor was known for his romantic connections to a number of high-profile women, including Sally Field and Lainey Anderson. In the end, Reynolds' legacy is one of both triumph and struggle. His contributions to the world of film and television are undeniable, and his charm and good looks will be remembered for generations to come. But his battles with addiction and the role that women played in his life serve as a reminder of the complexities and challenges that even the most successful and beloved figures can face. Burt Reynolds was a beloved actor, known for his exceptional talent and charisma. He gained fame for his roles in films like Deliverance and The Longest Yard, where he showcased his versatility and range. The actor's name became synonymous with on-screen excellence, and he quickly rose to become a household name. In addition to his acting abilities, Reynolds was also a favorite among fans for his personal life. His high-profile romances and tantalizing allure made him a constant topic of conversation and fascination. The actor's charm and good looks were undeniable, and he had a way of capturing the hearts of audiences both on and off the screen. Reynolds' success in the entertainment industry was recognized with numerous awards and accolades. He won the People's Choice Award for Favorite Motion Picture Actor and was named the All-Around Entertainer of the Year for five consecutive years within six. This was a testament to the actor's widespread popularity and enduring appeal. Despite the passage of time, Reynolds' legacy continues to live on. His classic films and memorable performances are still discussed and celebrated by fans today. The actor's impact on the entertainment industry is undeniable, and his contributions will be cherished for generations to come. Yet, it is important to remember that Reynolds was not just a talented actor or a charming celebrity. He was a complex and multifaceted individual with a life and career that extended far beyond the silver screen. From his early days as a football player to his later years as a filmmaker, Reynolds' journey is a testament to his enduring spirit and determination. In the end, Burt Reynolds will always be remembered as a true classic in the world of acting. His talent, charm, and charisma have left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry, and his legacy will continue to resonate for years to come. Burt Reynolds was known for his charming smile and crinkled eyes that won over the hearts of many female audience members. His charismatic personality was so powerful that it brought ecstasy to his viewers leaving them eagerly awaiting more of him off-screen. This magnetic appeal led to numerous encounters with admiring fans. At the pinnacle of his career, the actor made headlines by posing half-naked for the centerfold of an international magazine. The daring move sent shockwaves through the industry and captivated the attention of millions worldwide. Even today, people still remember this iconic moment in entertainment history. Reynolds' impact extended beyond just his good looks and charm as a talented actor he delivered memorable performances in various films and shows throughout his career. From action flicks to comedies, his work resonates deeply with those who grew up watching these classics. The legacy left behind by Burt Reynolds continues to inspire aspiring actors today. Through his artistry, he created unforgettable moments that transcended generations, forever etching himself into cinema history. Despite being gone, his presence remains palpable among moviegoers young and old alike. After all, one can never forget the man whose infectious grin and sparkling gaze stole their heart.
In the prime of his career, Burt Reynolds was a force to be reckoned with in Hollywood. His rugged good looks and undeniable charm made him a favorite among audiences, and his performances in films like Deliverance cemented his status as a talented actor. However, things took a turn for the worse later in his life. After years of performing his own daring stunts, the physical toll began to show. Reynolds suffered from chronic pain and eventually lost much of his muscle mass due to injury and surgery. At one point, he was unable to walk without assistance. This decline in health was a stark contrast to the strong and vital image he had cultivated throughout his career. Despite his struggles, Reynolds remained a beloved figure in Hollywood. Many remembered him fondly for his contributions to classic films and television shows. But behind the scenes, it seemed that his personal life had become chaotic. There were reports of financial troubles and failed relationships, which added to the sense that the actor's fortunes had taken a downward turn. It was sad to see someone who had enjoyed so much success and fame fall on hard times. Yet even in his darkest moments, Reynolds never lost his spirit or sense of humor. He continued to work, albeit at a slower pace than before, and always approached each project with enthusiasm and dedication. Looking back on his career, it's clear that Burt Reynolds left an indelible mark on Hollywood. From his early days as a football star to his rise as a leading man, he captivated audiences with his charismatic presence and unforgettable performances. Even though he faced challenges in his later years, he will always be remembered as a true icon of American cinema. Furthermore, Burton Leon Reynolds Jr., the son of Harriet Fournette and Burton Reynolds, was born in 1936. His family ancestry can be traced back to Dutch, English, Scots-Irish, and Scottish roots. Reynolds hinted at being born in Lansing, Michigan, a place he lived before his father was conscripted to the United States Army. Aging and addiction complicated his health issues, leading to multiple surgeries to stay alive. Born Burton Leon Reynolds Jr. on February 11, 1936, in Lansing, Michigan, the actor had an early passion for sports. His family moved several times during his childhood, finally settling in Riviera Beach, Florida. Here, Reynolds discovered his love for football and displayed remarkable talent as a high school player. He even earned a scholarship to Florida State University due to his impressive freshman season. Unfortunately, fate struck when Reynolds suffered a severe knee injury, threatening his promising football career. To make matters worse, a subsequent car accident left the other knee damaged. This unfortunate turn of events ultimately spelled the end of Reynolds' aspirations in professional football. Turning to education, Reynolds enrolled at Palm Beach Junior College and continued to harbor hopes of returning to FCU to play football. However, despite his efforts, the lingering impact of the car crash hampered his performance on the field. Following a particularly disappointing game where his teammates unfairly held him responsible for their defeat, Reynolds made the difficult decision to let go of his football dreams. After leaving football, Burt Reynolds found himself drawn to acting. It all started when he won the Florida State Drama Award while attending Palm Beach Junior College. This victory sparked his interest in the performing arts, and he decided to give it a try under the guidance of his English teacher, Watson B. Duncan. Duncan had noticed Reynolds' talent for reciting Shakespeare in class and encouraged him to participate in the play Outward Bound. Reynolds was given the lead role, and his performance earned him the school drama trophy. It's no wonder he considered Duncan his mentor and a powerful influence in his life. Reynolds' love for acting was ignited by his English teacher's faith in his abilities. With Duncan's support, he discovered his passion for the stage and began his journey in the world of entertainment. The actor's natural talent and dedication to his craft were nurtured under the tutelage of this influential figure, shaping his future in the industry. After growing up in Florida, Burt Reynolds decided to move to New York to try his luck in theater. He was soon discovered by a Hollywood studio and started his journey in earnest. But there was something special about Reynolds' personality that made him stand out. His charm and good looks caught the attention of many beautiful women, making him quite popular among his peers. His college roommate, Lee Corso, even admitted to using Reynolds as bait to attract women. According to Corso, if he wanted to impress a girl, all he had to do was bring Reynolds along, and the ladies would flock to them. This reputation followed Reynolds throughout his career, earning him a playboy image both on and off screen. Despite these distractions, Reynolds remained focused on his acting goals. He starred in numerous films and TV shows over the years, becoming one of the most recognizable faces in Hollywood. With each role, he brought charisma and talent, leaving a lasting impression on audiences around the world. Reynolds' appeal went beyond just his physical attributes. 
He had a magnetic energy that drew people in and kept them engaged. Whether he was playing a tough guy or a lovable rogue, viewers couldn't help but root for him. And when he smiled, hearts melted. It's clear that Burt Reynolds left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. From his early days in New York to his rise to stardom in Hollywood, he proved himself to be more than just a pretty face. Through hard work and dedication, he became a beloved actor who will always be remembered for his contributions to this classic art form. Burt Reynolds had a reputation with women that was quite noticeable. The actor, known for his charm and good looks, was often seen with beautiful women on his arm. However, there was a unique aspect to his relationships. Burt had a friend named Lee, who would accompany him when he went to college campuses to meet students. Lee was not as handsome as Burt, but he was always happy to be with the less attractive girl that Burt would bring back. The reason for Lee's contentment was that he believed Burt's less attractive girlfriends were still better than anyone else could get. This anecdote highlights the actor's popularity with women. However, Burt's romantic life extended beyond his college days. His affairs with various women are well documented. His marriage with actress Judy Karn ended, and he later warmed the bed of the much older Dinah Shore. Subsequently, he had relationships with singer Tammy Wynette and actress Sally Field, who was one of his most beloved partners. In summary, Burt Reynolds had a reputation as a ladies' man, and his relationships with women were varied and numerous. From his college days to his Hollywood years, the actor was often seen with beautiful women, and his romantic life was the subject of much speculation and interest. After becoming a movie prodigy and starring in the popular Gunsmoke television series, Burt Reynolds decided to try marital life. During a promotional tour for one of his movies, he met Judy Carn. The two soon tied the knot in 1963, but their union lasted only three years before ending in divorce in 1966. Reynolds then moved on and started dating French actress Dinah Shore, who was 20 years his senior. Their relationship raised eyebrows due to the significant age difference between them. However, it ended in 1971, and Reynolds began seeing other women. During this time, the actor fell for a cocktail waitress named Pam Seals, which caused some controversy. Despite being involved with her, Reynolds married another woman, Lonnie Anderson, in 1988. Together, they adopted a son, Quentin. But unfortunately, their marriage also did not last forever, and ended in 1994. Throughout his career, Burt Reynolds was known for his candidness regarding his relationships with women. He often spoke openly about how these relationships affected him emotionally. In fact, he admitted that many of his romantic entanglements had left him feeling vulnerable. Despite the controversies surrounding his love life, Reynolds remained unapologetic about his choices. He believed that everyone deserved happiness and pursued what he thought would bring him contentment. Even though his relationships were far from perfect, he never shied away from discussing them publicly. To sum up, Burt Reynolds had several high-profile relationships throughout his life, including marriages to Judy Carn and Lonnie Anderson. His involvement with Pam Seals stirred controversy, but the actor continued to pursue his personal interests regardless. Throughout all these experiences, Reynolds learned valuable lessons about himself and life, making him wiser and more resilient. Burt Reynolds first laid eyes on Judy Carn during the early 1960s, and he was instantly smitten. He described her as so adorable and funny with an immoral body and a wild spirit that drew him in. She would often dance on tabletops, which further added to her allure. In contrast, Reynolds saw himself as a traditional Southern gentleman. Despite their differences, he found himself falling deeply in love with Carn. Their affair began when Carn invited Reynolds over for dinner one evening. She had prepared a delicious meal, which she used to great effect to win him over completely. From then on, they became virtually inseparable. Their relationship moved quickly, and it wasn't long before they decided to tie the knot. They got married in 1963, marking the start of what many thought would be a happily ever after story. Unfortunately, things didn't turn out quite as planned. Although their marriage started off strong, they soon faced numerous challenges that ultimately led to their divorce just two years later. Nevertheless, Reynolds never forgot his first wife, always remembering her fondly as the woman who captured his heart with her infectious energy, sharp wit, and undeniable charm. In 1963, Burt Reynolds tied the knot with actress Judy Carn, marking the start of their whirlwind romance. However, sadly, just two years after the union, their relationship hit rocky waters, ultimately leading to divorce. When asked about the reason behind their split, Reynolds admitted that his heart had been shattered. He claimed that he had loved Karn deeply, but there were underlying issues that could not be resolved. 
Despite his reputation as a Hollywood playboy, Reynolds took the breakup hard and remained unmarried for many years afterward. His love for Karn left a deep impression on him, making it difficult for him to move on to another serious relationship. Burt Reynolds' marriage was known for its luxury, but his bachelorhood was equally notable. Despite remaining unmarried after his divorce, the actor wasn't short of female company. In fact, he had plenty of women in the background. Among them was a long-term relationship with Dinah Shore, a popular television host and singer. Their relationship began when Burt made an appearance on Dinah's talk show. Immediately, sparks flew between the two, and Burt became Dinah's youngest boyfriend. Their age difference didn't seem to matter, as Dinah was several years older than Burt. Yet, despite this, their love affair lasted for quite some time. However, something eventually happened that led to their separation. To this day, the reason behind their breakup remains unknown. But one thing is certain, their relationship left a lasting impression on both of them. Even after their split, Burt continued to hold Dinah in high regard, praising her kindness and generosity towards him during their time together. Thus, Burt Reynolds moved forward in life, leaving behind a trail of successful films and memorable relationships. His romantic journey may have been filled with ups and downs, but it never stopped him from being one of Hollywood's most beloved actors. Burt Reynolds once shared an adventure with Dinah Shore that left a lasting impression on him. During a camping trip, they found themselves lost in the wilderness. Despite being in Dinah's territory, Reynolds took charge and managed to lead them back to safety. This experience seemed bittersweet for him, expressing gratitude towards Dinah, while also feeling relieved to have escaped what he saw as a restrictive situation. He even hinted that encounters with strong-willed women like Dinah might contribute to his belief that women could make men feel weak and helpless. Fast forward to the early 90s, after nearly a decade of bachelorhood, Burt Reynolds decided to remarry. His first marriage had ended disastrously, but perhaps enough time had passed for him to consider giving love another chance. Unfortunately, the outcome wasn't much different than before. After a few short years, his second union crumbled too. It seems that the actor's relationships were marked by turbulence and difficulty. Maybe these experiences shaped his view on romance and commitment. Whatever the case, one thing remains clear. Burt Reynolds has lived quite an eventful life, both personally and professionally. In 1978, the actor Burt Reynolds met Lanny Anderson on The Merv Griffin Show. Reynolds was known for his philandering ways, but something about Anderson caught his attention. He was impressed by her intelligence and wit, a refreshing change from the airheads he had previously dated. It took him a year and a half, but eventually, he gathered the courage to ask Anderson to marry him. Reynolds had been married once before, to Judy Carn, but that marriage had ended in divorce in 1966. This time around, he was determined to make it work. He and Anderson tied the knot in a private ceremony, surrounded by close friends and family. Their marriage was not without its challenges, however. Reynolds' career was on the decline, and he struggled with addiction. Anderson, who had a successful career of her own, found it difficult to watch her husband spiral out of control. Despite their struggles, the couple remained married for six years, eventually divorcing in 1994. Looking back on his marriage to Anderson, Reynolds said, I loved her very much, and I think she loved me, but we were just too different. Despite their differences, their marriage was a significant chapter in both of their lives, and it remains a topic of interest for fans of the actor. Throughout his career, Reynolds was known for his charm and charisma, both on and off the screen. His marriage to Anderson was just one of many chapters in his life, but it is a chapter that remains etched in the memories of his fans. Even today, people are still intrigued by the story of how this classic Hollywood heartthrob fell in love with a beautiful and intelligent woman, despite the challenges they faced. Following his marriage struggles with Lanny Anderson, the actor's life was bedeviled with epic tales of struggle and unending grief. It wasn't clear when or how it started, but facts suggest that Burt Reynolds became addicted to sleeping pills known as Halcyon for over four years after sustaining an injury on his jaw while shooting the 1984 City Heat. Reports indicate that the pain from the injury made him restless, leading him to consume as many as 50 pills a day to cope with the intense discomfort he experienced. In the late 1970s, Burt Reynolds was at the height of his career, known for his roles in films like Smokey and The Bandit and Deliverance, but behind the scenes, the actor struggled with addiction to the prescription sedative Halcyon. This powerful drug left him vulnerable to complications, and one day, he slipped into a coma. His close call served as a wake-up call, pushing Reynolds to confront his dependency. 
Halcyon, which has been associated with memory loss and hallucinations, faced increased scrutiny following Reynolds' overdose. Eventually, it became outlawed in Great Britain due to its dangerous side effects. Meanwhile, the United States Food and Drug Administration continued examining the substance's safety. Thankfully, Reynolds managed to recover, but the incident underscored the dangers posed by abusing prescribed medications. Despite his struggles, Reynolds persisted in Hollywood. He returned to acting and even directed several projects throughout the years. Still, the memory of his brush with death lingered, serving as a cautionary tale regarding the perils of addiction. In 2009, Burt Reynolds, the beloved actor known for his roles in classic films such as Deliverance and Smokey and The Bandit, opened up about a near-death experience that left him with a painful injury. After surviving the incident, Reynolds knew that fans would be eager to know what had happened. In an interview with the media, he shared his story, explaining that he had been helpless in the situation. The actor's near-death experience served as a stark warning to others, highlighting the dangers that can arise when we least expect them. But regardless of whether Reynolds' story would serve as a cautionary tale or not, one thing was clear this harrowing experience was not something that anyone would want to go through. During the incident, Reynolds had broken and shattered his temporal mandibular joint, a painful injury that caused him immense discomfort. According to the actor, the pain was more intense than a migraine, and he compared it to having an army of people trying to escape from his head through his ears, eyes, and nose. The aftermath of the injury left Reynolds in a great deal of pain, and he required extensive medical treatment to recover. Despite the challenges he faced, the actor remained positive and focused on his recovery, determined to get back to doing what he loved most acting. Today, Burt Reynolds is remembered as one of the most iconic actors of his generation. With a career that spanned decades and included some of the most memorable films in Hollywood history, his near-death experience was just one chapter in a life that was filled with both triumph and tragedy, but it was a powerful reminder of the fragility of life and the importance of cherishing every moment. In 1995, Burt Reynolds found himself in a dire situation. He was battling constant pain, which led him down a dangerous path of dependency on prescription drugs. The actor later revealed that he would consume large amounts of medication to find relief, admitting that there were times when he took up to 35 painkillers a day. This reckless behavior put his life in peril, eventually leading to a near-death experience. Reynolds lapsed into a coma that lasted for approximately 8 or 9 hours while being treated at a hospital in Los Angeles. During this harrowing period, the actor went through a personal out-of-body experience of dying. Although he was unconscious, he recalled hearing medical staff inform his wife, Lainey Anderson, that they were losing him. At one point, Anderson was even advised to bid her final farewells to her husband, who lay motionless and unaware of the conversation taking place around him. Despite the grim circumstances, Reynolds managed to pull through this traumatic event. His miraculous recovery served as a stark reminder of the dangers associated with substance abuse, prompting the actor to seek help and regain control over his health. Burt Reynolds' health issues were not typical of a drug addiction. When he regained consciousness after a near-death experience, he realized the gravity of his situation. He had been taking a painkiller called Halcyon, and the doctors informed him that another dose could have been fatal. Reynolds wrote in his memoir about this harrowing experience, stating that it was a wake-up call for him. He learned from the doctors that he had come very close to dying, and the reality of the situation made him determined to never take Halcyon again. Just when fans thought that the actor's health battle was over, a new phase of health issues emerged. Several months after his near-death experience, Burt Reynolds entered rehab due to the same issue. The experience was no doubt difficult for the actor, but he emerged from it stronger and more determined to maintain his health and well-being. His resilience and determination serve as an inspiration to many, and his story is a reminder of the importance of taking care of oneself and seeking help when needed. In 2014, Burt Reynolds took a significant step towards addressing his health struggles. Despite his rugged image as a tough guy in films like Deliverance and Smokey and The Bandit, the actor admitted that he could not overcome his addiction to prescription pills alone. After attempting to quit multiple times, he realized that seeking professional help was necessary. This decision required courage, especially considering the scandal often associated with celebrities entering rehab. The primary reason for his apprehension lay in the potential backlash from the media and the public. High-profile individuals frequently shy away from seeking treatment due to the ensuing controversy. However, Reynolds chose to confront the issue openly, 
demonstrating his commitment to overcoming his challenges. By admitting himself into rehab, he joined the ranks of other brave personalities who have sought assistance amidst intense scrutiny. As a testament to his bravery, Burt Reynolds did not allow the fear of negative publicity to prevent him from receiving much-needed care. His journey serves as a reminder that even those perceived as strong can face internal battles requiring external support. As fans continue to cherish his iconic roles in various classics, they must also recognize the human side of their favorite stars, one susceptible to flaws yet resilient enough to conquer them. Through Reynolds' story, we learn that seeking help is crucial when facing personal obstacles, regardless of the potential scandals attached. Burt Reynolds, the famous actor, had his fair share of health issues. In 2009, he underwent back surgery, which was a significant challenge for him, but that was not all. The following year, he had to face another major health scare, a quintuple bypass surgical procedure. Despite these hurdles, he managed to regain his health after several years. When asked about his infamous nude pose in the 1972 print publication, he admitted that it was a mistake. He said, I wished I hadn't done that. It was stupid to have done that. I don't know what I was thinking. However, one can't deny that this bold move was a reflection of the youthful exuberance that is often associated with the film industry. The actor, known for his roles in films and TV shows, was a classic case of a notorious Casanova that the industry is filled with. His charm and charisma were undeniable, making him a favorite among fans. Despite his mistakes, he remained a beloved figure in the industry, a testament to his enduring appeal. Throughout his career, Burt Reynolds had a way of resonating with his audience, leaving a mark that transcended the silver screen. His impact is still felt today, a testament to his lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. Even when faced with health issues, he remained a captivating figure, etching his name in the annals of Hollywood history. Burt Reynolds, known for his charismatic charm and good looks, made a name for himself in Hollywood with a string of successful films throughout the 70s and 80s. His fame and fortune were significant, and he was often seen surrounded by luxury properties around the world. One of his most high-profile affairs was with his Cannonball Run co-star, Farrah Fawcett. Despite his success, Reynolds faced financial troubles, which came to a head during his divorce from Lanny Anderson. The settlement required him to sell many of his luxury properties, but the actor's lively spirit couldn't be dampened. He was often seen frolicking with cocktail waitresses or gambling his money in infamous get-rich-quick ventures. Even though Reynolds was already wealthy, he couldn't resist turning down roles that most actors would lobby to get. His financial troubles didn't stop him from living life to the fullest, and he remained a fixture in Hollywood for decades. Reynolds' ability to bounce back from setbacks was a testament to his resilient spirit. Even when faced with financial difficulties, he remained true to himself and continued to pursue his passions. His legacy as a Hollywood legend is secure, and his fans will always remember him for his infectious charm and unforgettable performances. Just moments before his sudden death, Burt Reynolds could be found rehearsing lines with his assistant, preparing for one more performance. This classic actor, known for his charismatic charm and rugged good looks, still held on to his passion for acting until the very end. As news of his passing spread, many were quick to recall their favorite roles of his, whether it be the smooth-talking bandit in Smokey and the Bandit, or the charming con man in The Longest Yard. With a career spanning over five decades, the actor left behind an impressive body of work filled with unforgettable performances. But beyond his success on screen, Burt Reynolds also made headlines for his personal life. His romantic relationships, friendships, and feuds have all been subjects of speculation and gossip throughout his career. Despite this, those who knew him best described him as an infectiously positive presence, always ready with a joke or kind word. Indeed, even in his final moments, the actor remained dedicated to his craft. Rehearsing lines right up until his last breath serves as a testament to his lifelong love of acting. And while scandal may have surrounded him at times, it is ultimately his talent and contributions to the world of cinema that will be remembered most fondly by fans everywhere. Still, one cannot help but wonder what went through the actor's mind in those final moments. Did he reflect on his storied career? Or perhaps reminisce about old memories with friends and loved ones? Only time will tell. But for now, let us remember Burt Reynolds not just for the scandals that surrounded him, but for his undeniable talent and impact on the entertainment